What's up guys, COD Gameplay here, and uh, if you guys haven't heard, Hutch quit YouTube, Twitter, um, he quit his job at Machinima, and honestly, if you would have told me that around a week ago, I would have said, there's no way, there's no way that he would do that, like, this community, he pretty much made this community, there would be no reason for him to quit, but he did, and it's it's pretty astonishing me. Like I saw the tweets by Gold Glove, and then someone else, and I was like, "There's no way in hell that Hutch quit Machinima." I was like, "If he did, then he must be going back to his YouTube channel, right?" I watched the video. He's like, "No, I'm done with YouTube, and I'm done with Twitter." And then I was just like, "Holy crap!" I honestly don't know what to say right now. Like I'm speechless right now. The last when I heard yesterday, I heard around like probably around four o'clock yesterday. So it's been around twenty four hours since then, and I've been legitimately pretty sad, just in general, about like every like. It's really weird how I I I saw Hutch at Pax Prime, and like he, you can tell by his videos, he's just a really really unique individual. He was the one, he is the father of the Call of Duty community. If there was no Hutch, there would be no me. I would not be making videos. When I first saw my ever, like my first ever Call of Duty video that I saw on YouTube was Hutch's quickscope tutorial on World at War. And I, I subscribed to him right away. He had less than 1,000 subscribers at that time. I believe he had like somewhere around 600. And he, I just watched him grow. I watched him grow as a person as a figure, as like a player, everything. I always watch every single one of his videos. I would come home from school and Hutch, Hutch would have a new video out and I'd be like, oh my God, yes, sit down, grab like an iced tea. I just sit there and watch his videos. And sometimes he didn't have a video that day. I might've missed it. I'd check his channel. I had his channel bookmarked on my computer. That is how much Hutch like meant to me. And it's scary, like, I I almost, like, based my channel at the beginning off of him. Like, he was my role model at the start, and uh, I'd just like to thank him. He doubt he's watching this, because uh, it's a very slim chance, but uh, I'd like to thank him from the bottom of my heart, because I don't know where I'd be if there was no YouTube. I'd probably have a job at, like, a, uh, I don't know, like a supermarket or something? Some, somewhere like food? I have no clue. And uh, probably hating my job and doing school and stuff, not being able to have as much free time, so many things like not just money wise, but everything. It's, it's just that it, it YouTube has made me a better person, it's opened my eyes to so many things. And hell, I just got accepted to Simon Fraser University BD School of Business, and one of the reasons was because of YouTube, my entrepreneur skills which were because of YouTube and because of all you guys. Without YouTube, without Hutch, I would have no YouTube channel. Without no, any YouTube channel, I might not have been accepted to SFU. So, it's really, it, it caught me off guard so much and I'm almost speechless right now. Because w it's, if he kept his Twitter and he said, okay, I'm quitting Machinima, I might be posting a couple videos like every, like once, one video every couple months. Keep you guys updated, keep tweeting. I'd be, I'd probably be fine with it, but just the fact that he's gone, and maybe you'll never hear from him again, maybe, like, he's, yeah, he's gone, like, forever, on the internet, internet, like, I doubt it, but it's a possibility, just think of that possibility of, basically, my, it's kind of sad, like, it's kind of, it's not homosexual, anyway, I'm trying to say this, but, like, my idol on YouTube, that's basically what, what Hutch was. He was a father of the Call of Duty community. Without without Hutch, I guarantee you, Woody's gamer tag, C Nanners, and who else? I'm trying to think of who else. Oh, Wings of Redemption. They would all not be big. I guarantee you. Hutch promoted Woody's gamer tag at the very beginning so largely. He did so many dual comms that C Nanners promoted him. And Wings of Redemption, at the very beginning, he had videos with him doing dual commentaries, and there was a huge, like, 
uh, kerfuffle with him and uh, and with Wings of Redemption, but I don't know. I have I have no clue. Like I going into this commentary, this is not scripted at all. I never script my commentaries, but this is one where I'm I'm literally lost for words because I don't know what to say. If you guys uh, don't know Hutch and you guys are watching this video, go check him out. Go to check his channel. Yesterday I was watching his videos and I was getting so huge nostalgia. Unbelievable. Like just remember coming home from school, watching his videos. Put he puts a smile on so many people's faces. And uh, I wish him best of luck with whatever he chooses to do in the future though. So uh, anyways, I'll catch you guys later. And if Hutch you're watching this video, thank you and farewell.